Hello students, I hope you all are doing great and preparing well for your KCET exam. So in today's video, we will be looking at the most repeated question that was asked from integrals chapter. So this question was asked, uh, this question is based on a very standard result that is already present in our K, uh, NCRT textbook. So first thing we will be doing is, we will be doing a quick concept recap. We will be studying the, uh, the standard result and then we will start solving questions. Okay, so let's start today's video. So the standard result is e power x. So you have e power x and in bracket you have f of x plus f dash of x dx. Then you no need to do integration. You can directly write down e power x into f of x plus c. So this is the standard result that you need to know to solve questions okay so one more tip that i would like to share with you with you all is whenever you look at e power x in a de indefinite integral or a definite integral you should have this result in your mind try to apply try to transform try to manipulate the given integral into this form okay so that we can apply this standard result so we will be looking at some questions then you will get an idea okay so this particular question was asked in 2015 okay so let's see so here as you can see e power x term is there right so we have to change this part in this form right f of x plus f dash of x okay let's try doing that okay so you have e power x 1 plus sin x divided by 1 plus cos x dx okay okay fine e power x this can be written as 1 by 1 plus cos x plus sin x 1 plus cos x okay fine dx now we will use trigonometric identity trigonometric formula 1 plus cos x if you remember we have studied in first year 1 plus cos x is nothing but 2 cos square x by 2 and sin x is nothing but 2 sin x by 2 cos x by 2 and 1 plus cos x is 2 cos square x by 2 dx. So now this entire thing is equal to e power x 1 by 2 6 square x by 2 plus 2 2 gets cancelled cos gets cancelled with cos so i have left with tan x by 2 right so if you observe carefully if i take this as f of x and this as i can take this as f dash of x because differentiation of tan x by 2 is 6 square x by 2 and differentiation of x by 2 is 1 by 2 so i can directly write e power x tan x by 2 plus c so the correct answer is option a so this is how whenever you see e power x in an integral question try to apply this formula okay try to change the given integral in this form and apply the standard result so again the same question same question was asked in 2021 so it is very important to solve every previous year question okay so i have a playlist called pyq questions don't miss the videos don't miss any of the videos there is a very high chance videos will appear uh, questions will appear from previous years as you can see here 2015 question same question has appeared in 2021 moving on yeah these kind of question this is another favorite question of examiner we'll let's try to understand how to solve this again we will be trying to apply the standard result for that we need to change this how can I change that? Okay. It is very easy. Try to change x minus 1. Try to change this x minus 1. Try to write it as x plus 1. Okay. Let's write that as x plus 1. Okay. If I write this as x plus 1, I have to minus 1 because I have added 1. Minus 1 is already there. I hope this step is clear. I have added 1 and subtracted minus 1. Minus 1 is already there. 
so now it becomes x plus 1 minus 2 x plus 1 whole cube dx sorry e power x this can be further can be written as x plus 1 divided by x plus 1 whole cube minus 2 by x plus 1 cube e power x dx now this x plus 1 x plus 1 gets cancelled you are left with 1 by x plus 1 whole square minus 2 by x plus 1 whole cube e power x so tell me what is f of x and what is f of f dash of x if you observe carefully if i take this as my f of x this will be my f dash of x because differentiation of 1 by x plus 1 whole square is nothing but minus 2 by x plus 1 whole cube so my answer is e power x 1 by x plus 1 whole square plus c so the correct answer is option b c thus the thing that you need to remember is you have to try to manipulate the given integral in this form okay e power x f of x plus f of f dash of x and then apply the standard trigger okay we will solve one more question we will get a clear idea so this question was asked in 2017 so the method is same okay so we will be do, trying to do the same things x plus 3 e power x x plus 4 whole square dx so try to write the numerator in terms of denominator it is x plus 3 so i will add 1 and subtract 1 right let me see what do i get now so now it becomes x plus 4 minus 1 x plus 4 whole square e power x x plus 4 divided by x plus 4 whole square minus 1 by x plus 4 whole square dx now we we'll get this gets cancelled and you get 1 by x plus 4 minus 1 by x plus 4 whole square i think most of you got the answer so the answer is you can take this as your f of x and this as your f dash of x because differentiation of 1 by x plus 4 is minus 1 by x plus 4 whole square so the integral the integration is e power x 1 by x plus 4 plus c i hope everyone understood the method to solve this question okay the correct answer is option a so this question was asked in 2017 this will take you hardly a minute it can be easily solved in one minute you just need to know what you need to apply so whenever you see e power x the first thing that should come to your mind is can i apply the standard result okay. this is not true for every question but you should have a, have this in mind can i apply this or then try for other methods like you have substitution method or the other method you can try okay so moving on okay again this question was asked in 2021 i would like to solve this again so that it becomes crystal clear a very solid concept is built up so let's let me just solve this one question okay so again in the denominator i have 1 plus x so in the numerator i have to have 1 plus x, 1 plus x. so if i if i add 1 i have to subtract 1 so yeah so this is nothing but x plus 1 1 plus x minus 1 by 1 plus x okay so what do i get 1 by 1 plus x this gets cancelled and you have minus 1 by 1 plus x whole square e power x so this is my f of x and this is my f dash of x so the answer is e power x f of x the correct answer is option t okay i hope everyone is getting okay moving on okay this question was asked in 2022 so i would like you to solve this question this is solve this like a integral first and then you have to apply the limits the lower limit is 0 and the upper limit is 1 I want everyone to solve this question and tell the correct answer for this question in the comment section. 
so i'll be checking your comments okay so this is this was the last question i hope this video was helpful to you you got something new to learn uh, and if so don't forget to press the like button and uh, share this with your friends so that they also benefit from this video thank you